Hey everybody, Mrs. Bodishan here. So this is for the chemistry teachers out there. I do a mold day celebration every single year with my students and it goes over so well. I wanna show you how you can do it in your classroom too. So first off, we know the mole is Avogadro's number. Um, so the date of mole day is gonna be 1023 or October 23rd. In all honesty, I never have mole day on October 23rd. Feel free to, but I usually do mole day the review day right before our test of the moles unit. So that's when I recommend it, but of course you do mole day when you wanna do mole day. All right, so I asked my kids to do a couple of different things. The first one was to make a, ma a mascot, mole. So I gave them the template and they could either sew it, they could hot glue it. Um, I recommend using felt because felt is a very cheap and inexpensive material, but if they want to, they could even just use an old sock, okay? Um, and just um, sew it together, glue it together, whatever, whatever it is they can do to keep it bind together. Um, and then I told them to be creative. So come up with some kind of theme or inspiration behind your mole and make it look super cute because I do decorate my classroom in these. And these are some of the ones that I got this past year. You can see we have an aerial, a cow, we have like a strawberry. So there's like so many different ones that my students brought in. Have fun with this. You can do something like give them extra credit or bonus points or whatever you want, or just make it a fun day. Um, so what I did on my part, you guys, I am not a Pinterest teacher, okay? <laughs> but I wanted to make it special for the kids. So I printed out these cute little mole posters and I got some streamers from the dollar store and just kind of made the classroom into something special and unique. So when they came in, they thought, whoa, this is a special day for us, right? They had so much fun with it. And I asked them to make mole inspired food. So it either had to have the name mole in it or it had to look like a mole. So you can see they made like brownies, cookies, cupcakes that look like a mole, but they also did things that had the word mole in it. So let me show you a couple examples. And I know that these aren't all spelled correctly, but this is fun, remember? So like limonade, right? Or guacamole, and then water molen, okay? So they all brought in lots of food. We had a great time. And what I ended up doing for that review day was I had like a station rotation where they would go around, eat some food, drink some lemonade, right? And then um, answer the questions before rotating around to the next review station. Uh, and this gave a very light feel to the day. It was very fun, exciting for the students, but they still did their review while partaking in this fun little like party-ish activity. So I hope this was helpful, you guys. Try this out with your students. I promise you, you're not gonna regret it. The kids are gonna love it. Just give it a try. Um, go ahead, like, subscribe to my channel to see more of my chemistry ideas, and I will see y'all next time. Bye, everybody.